Hello, welcome to Infinite Breaths Breathing Tips. Today I have two very simple techniques that could help if you have symptoms of coronavirus and they could help you prevent, okay? Because it's a respiratory, it develops into a respiratory illness and we need to open the lungs as much as we can and get some oxygen in there and basically not do shallow breathing into our chest, okay? Now this is a very simple technique, but I want you to, number one, follow me. I'm gonna explain it. I'm gonna go through it once and then we'll go to the second one, okay? So you're gonna breathe in deeply through your nose or through your mouth. If your nose is blocked, obviously your mouth is better because you can get more air in. So you're gonna breathe in deeply towards the lower part of the body, more, um, more larger part of our lungs are here. Breathing in here and here, breathe in deep, hold for five seconds, then breathe out. Then breathe in deep again, hold for five seconds and breathe out. We do this five times. Now on the sixth time, we breathe in, we hold, and then we breathe out with a cough, like a <coughs> kind of agitating the lungs slightly, but good deep cough without really, really forcing, but make it a good deep cough. Then we repeat the process. So five breaths on the sixth breath, a cough. Then we repeat again five more times on the sixth breath, a cough. And then we simply find a place to lie down the sofa or the bed is best. And then place a pillow. On your, lie on the pillow on your chest here, more or less in this area, lying on the pillow and trying to concentrate on breathing deeply, not again forcing, but breathing deeply towards the lower part of your lungs, okay? Around here and around here is where we can breathe in and get more oxygen into the lungs in this entire area. So for five minutes then, simply breathing deep into the whole body, the lower part of the lungs, while lying flat. Because at nighttime when you're lying on your back, you're reducing the amount of oxygen you can get into the lungs, okay? It's not so good if you do have the Simpsons symptoms. Lying on your back the entire time is not good. We wanna lie on our front and breathe deeply and get more air into the lungs, okay? So after, the, after this exercise, for five minutes, you lie down, pillow here, and just breathe deeply and relax. Simply breathe deeply and relax, okay? I'm gonna go through this once, so follow me or copy me, and then try it yourself, okay? So, Then repeat that process for the second time. On the sixth, you breathe in, you exhale with a cough. Here, I was covering the cough, obviously, not to, no one's here to infect anyone. Cough deeply, then lying down for five or so minutes, just lying down with a pillow here, relaxing, breathing deeply, breathing into your lower back here as much as possible to agitate, activate, and drain the lungs as well. Tip two, okay? Very, very simple one, which I repeat a lot in my classes, workshops, and online, is you want to focus on your exhale, okay? You want to focus on your exhale. We want to reduce the amount of carbon dioxide in the body, and breathe in nice and deep, but also when we breathe in, it's a natural reflex, okay? When we're breathing out, it's not so much. You will breathe in naturally, but we need to concentrate on the exhale to relax the body as well, and we need to breathe deep. A lot of us are shallow breathing here, and especially if you have any conditions with respiratory illness, you don't want to be breathing here. You don't want to be breathing through your mouth if you can help it. If the nose is blocked or you have a problem, it's okay. But ideally, we want to be breathing here, okay? So we're breathing through the nose, towards the belly, and just focusing, focusing on the exhale. We're not too strict on how we do this for the seconds or anything, just focusing on the exhale. So simply...
focusing on the exhale, breathing in quite deep without forcing, but not breathing into the chest. Breathing towards here, diaphragmic breathing, to the lower part of your lungs. This is where, you have, where the more gases will exchange. If you breathe into the deeper part of your body, it's far better for your entire respiratory system. Breathing lower into your belly and breathing out through your lung, through your mouth for as long as you can. Try those. Hope they help. See you on the next video.